Yeah. People are weird. Okay. Oh. So what do you got there, Chris? Um Black Light. This, this is um part of Odyssey's Light Bright series. It's a blackberry sour. <laughs> <laughs> you have like a like a picture of a wizard or something that like you have to have a special light and it's all psychedelic. Yeah, yeah. And I oh, love awesome. I love sifting through colored pegs before I drink this beer. <laughs> oh I'm running low on beer. Are we? I'm not yeah. drinking a lot of beer these days. I know you're not. Although um, I did go out with Jim on because Jim's a bad influence, as you know. He told me not to blame him. I'm gonna blame I said him. I heard you got Matt drunk the other no, night. No, no, he, like, he hey, did. hey, hey, hey. He he didn't, but but we went out and and we got we got tacos and Jim's like well, I'll have a beer. And I'm like, well, okay, I'll have a beer too. I'm thinking I'm going to have one. And you know how it goes. You just sit around, you start talking and then you get another well, one. Yeah, and they're big. And, and that's what he so said. Big. He said, the next thing I know, Matt's getting another one. Yeah. So which, don't blame me. No, I, I can't really blame him, well, but you I'm can. going to anyway. Yeah. I like to blame Jim and I like yeah. to blame Brian Duncan. Yeah. Chris Hill. Yeah. 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 Oh yeah. Chris Hill. But, but you expect it yeah. from him. He's, he's in the business yeah. of, yeah. uh, yeah. Yeah. So, Okay, gang. Um, we're gonna just go ahead and, and kick this off. This is our final um uh our reveal of a three reveal Friday, which seemed like a good idea at the time. I still yeah. think it's a good idea. It's, it's a fine idea. We had two special guests, and we didn't want we did, and we... they and they the, the original idea was like I was kind of hoping they'd both be here at the same time, and that just didn't quite work out. Here's what I didn't want to do. One reveal with all the stuff that way, but like if Joe was like, oh, I want to check out my reveal, he'd have, well, crap, which one is it? You know, or yeah. Trevor says, I want to, hey, I want to show some people. Yeah, or, life. or, that yeah, oh, no, wait, fast forward, fast forward. Oh, oh that was me. No, yeah. Wait, wait. Uh, yeah. 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 I think it works better if there's just a guitar or two in yeah. each reveal. So these, the, so this last reveal, uh, these are both, uh, both similar guitars. Chris, let me ask you a couple of questions. Can I act, ask you a question? You absolutely afterwards? can. Okay. Absolutely can. Chris, what is our top of the line guitar? Like it doesn't get any doesn't get any cooler than this. One. Well, I think um, the the Challenger Level Four Deluxe. Well, I think the Challenger Level Four, just in general, right? Well, yeah, but but I mean, anytime you add the word deluxe, okay, yeah. or LTD, yeah. Or but, uh, but hold on, so don't don't, don't ad lib here. I'm 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 going somewhere with this. Okay. So what's our top of the line guitar, Chris? Uh, Challenger Level Four. That's right. And what kind of what are some hallmarks of the Challenger Level Four? Well, the the Challenger Three and the Challenger Level Four are both handmade here at Texas Toast yeah. guitars, woodwork by Matt paint and uh everything else by chris so yeah so they're they're entirely handmade instruments yes um oh they're all hollow yes Some are hollow yeah so those are those are the two well that's where they start mm -hmm. the level four is um uh traditionally mahogany back yeah chambered mm -hmm. not just a bunch of holes drilled in it no. it's actually chambered two two down the side and one in the back if you yeah. were if you were going to put weed in there you could put a lot, a lot of, of weed, weed in there yeah. um there'd be no way to get it get no. to it after the top well, in, the, in the, the bottom yeah the uh thick maple cap mm -hmm. um yeah carved top. full size carved top yep. sorry yeah yep. yeah carved top um yeah Thicker profile than say a level one or a level two, um, and the options are basically sky's the limit. Yeah, what do you want? Yeah. as you will see. Yeah, uh, yeah. So we've got yeah. two two level fours. Mm -hmm. They're they're both level fours, but they're both very very different. Guitars. They are, yeah, and they have a lot of similarities, mm -hmm. but they also have a lot of differences, mm -hmm. which will become obvious. Yeah. So, uh, so, but like. Both of these really do, like I say, they're, they're top of the line Texas Toast guitars. Mm -hmm. um, different finishes, different, different appointments, different inlay, different all that stuff. Um, but they're both carved top or both mahogany back, uh, semi hollow or chambered. Or how, yeah, how yeah. It goes. Mm -hmm. um, so get your checkbooks out because this is. You guys are gonna want th this is. You know how like people are like I can't afford that guitar. This is the one they're talking. These are the ones you can't afford. <laughs> this is the one. um yeah, and and it, don't worry if you don't like one, you'll like the other. Yeah, and vice yeah. versa. Yeah, 
Um, but lots of payment options. And they're, because they're all handmade, you got lots of time to pay it off. Yeah, yeah. Don't it expect to get one of these in 60 takes days. takes more than a minute to, to get these done. Yep. For a handful of reasons. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so which ones do you want to show off first? Um, well, let's... Which one's the oldest one? This one. All right, let's show this guy off here. So this one is for... Joe Do Delicious. That's right. I can't pronounce his last name, and I came up with Do Delicious, and he said, "That's not really right, but but it's not, okay, but it's not really wrong." So, what do we yeah. got here, Chris? So this is um in well in in a lot of ways nothing like a standard level four. Um, he wanted silver metal flake. Mm -hmm. That's I think the the standout portion. It of this. is the yep. other thing that's very very different, and so far the only one like it is it has a hip shot uh, trim mm -hmm. on the big thick body. On a thick thick body. Yeah. Yep. How on earth did you do that? Well, it was uh, a little bit of this and a little bit of that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Um, two humbuckers, mahogany mahogany back, mahogany yep. neck. Uh, maple binding, maple reveal binding, the, which yep. is uh, a, a fun thing to do with with metal flake. Look at this. This is this could be in a Britney Fox video. It's, it it's should so... be in a Britney Fox. Yeah, video, maybe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah. Shiny paint. Uh huh. Yeah. This is buffed to within an inch of its life. Mm -hmm. Um. Uh. Ebony fretboard and dig. Yeah. The, yeah. Dig the Mike Nesmith inspired. Uh, Mike Nesmith. Mike Ness. No, Mike Nesmith. Nesmith. Yeah. The guy from the monkeys? The guy from the monkeys. Okay. Why would I lie about that? I thought you said, okay. No. Nope. It's just like his Gretsch? Yep. Okay. There's a picture of his guitar, and he says, I want the inlay to be just like that. He had a, he had a, he had one of them converted to a 12 string, and the next later broke off. I, I, well, it's funny that you should mention that. We were reading a little bit about that just the other day, but were what you? we're talking right. about now Sorry. is this. And so, yes, not Mike Ness, but Mike Nesmith's uh, 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 thumbnail on the top and dots on the box. Mm -hmm. It also has red side dots, but you can't see them because they, they just kind of got dark. Yeah. Yep. So, but as you can see, there's side dots. Yep. So this is, um, uh, yeah, I, he, Joe always asks for something, uh, uh, sparkly. And you guys might remember, uh, we did a video of his, Red sparkle base with an all rosewood neck with mandolin yeah. frets, and it was a yeah, it was a, a P base body with mm -hmm. a, a tort pick guard, mm -hmm. red metal flake, very very traditional red and metal. Two flake of those. Black. What were those pickups? Those dark uh, star. Um, yeah, weren't they the the uh, uh, uh the the Lawler um, Bison and and I, I can't Star remember. Yeah, they, they were they were so long big ago. big yeah. Yeah. or Curtis Novak or yeah, something. But they were yeah, they might have been Novaks. They, yeah. But it was yeah, it was a a very very cool base. Mm -hmm. And then he ordered this, and it was like yeah, that sounds easy compared to that other thing. I was wrong. Yeah, I was wrong. So yeah, this one is is positively uh 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 yeah the the metal flake is just it looks cool. like the robot from metropolis right yeah yeah now metal flake won't robot. make you play any better but it will get you laid faster so yeah. i heard i heard so friend, this is a yours, right you happen to a friend of mine yeah. actually it did um so yeah i don't man i don't i don't know chris what so yeah check this out this mahogany on the back is i like the the back to be natural and the top to be like ah oh, wowie zowie i think that's super cool yeah it turned out good so um, yeah yeah so uh now let's just say you wanted a level two um how close how close could we get to something like this in a level two it would be thinner it would be thinner. It, it would have seventy three finish. It wouldn't. It would be solider. It would be more solid. Uh -huh. Yeah. Um. I don't know. Yep. I mean, one of the problems with this stuff is shiny paint takes us a really long time to do. Yep. To the level that I want to do it. Yep. Um. So I'm trying yeah. to. I'm trying to get the paint in the. the it just it's the reflecting thing so is, much. Is it looks. 
And once again, it, it looks it looks pretty good on camera, but it looks ah, really good in person. Yeah, 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 this thing. And I'm trying to get yeah. the, the problem is there's some you well, you can, well, can see, see on the, the guitar. Light. Yeah, there's the, the light. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. See if you can get Joe's picture in there. Let's see if we can get Joe. He's in there. Yeah, there you go. There he is. Yeah, there he is. Okay. So yeah. Um, okay. So so this is a level four, and this is a uh, top of the line. Everything on this thing is um is is as cool as it gets and it's all hand done mm -hmm. okay so people who wonder what what's the big deal with um the level four because the level two is not too far from this but no. it's not it but it, it might as well be yeah uh, uh miles away yeah um the level two does still have all the all the best hardware we can get um it but but it's really it's 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 all about uh, how long it takes us to uh to manufacture that so in line but but wildly different Ooh, better get the birth control <laughs> oh, oh, oh oh my goodness i'll just hold this right there for the entire thing yeah i'm just gonna shut up do, 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 do. so this is a uh level four, we're calling this level four deluxe mm -hmm. um because it has that cc rider pickup yeah it's got the charlie christian pickup in it mm -hmm. um so we did a year ago year and a half ago we did a run of level threes with the charlie christian pickup and mike beckloff said that's really cool can you do it in a level four actually that's the way mike, i remember the well no story. mike has a has a, a level three does he have a level three yeah with the with the he, he has a, this he has a, a, a oh okay he so has he's a jjj so he has the deluxe. set yeah 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 nice job mm-hmm um, so anyway, he wanted one in a carve top. Mm -hmm. So we said, sure, why not? So he based this is essentially exactly like his uh level three, mm -hmm. um, but with a carve top. And this is the first the first carve top that we actually cut for that Pete Biltoff CC Rider Charlie Christian pickup. Mm -hmm. Um since then we've actually done a lot more, like say for it's like Seal Beach Mike has one. Um, there's two more in the in the back um, that that will be done soon. Some other people have ordered some. Um, it is it. This is it, it, it. This really is. This is the top of the line. They don't get. I can't think of anything. I can't think of anything that you could do to this guitar more than this one or this one to make them. I mean, like, yeah. I I don't. There's there's nothing yeah these are these these are both the same guitar they're both the 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 everything about them is 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 as good as you can possibly get and um, yeah and they're both they're both the same and they're both they're both different so yeah anyway so everybody asks what's the deal with those three screws oh those yeah. holding the neck no those are holding the pickup yeah and we put a clear plate on there so you can see. The way the 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 pickup is mounted, that's really just the elevator mm -hmm. um, mechanism for the pickup. Yep, and it's all based on the original Charlie Christian pickup, which was based on a uh, pedal steel or a lap steel yeah. pickup. So the original one, if you look at pictures of Charlie Christian, you'll see those three you'll screws. See, yeah, that's the defining characteristic. That and this shape. Yeah, of that pickup that. Uh, and what they did was they just kind of uh, clutched that into his sort of Gibson whatever and slid it into his jazz yeah. jazz box originally, uh -huh. and then made him mm -hmm. proceeded to make him for the next twenty or thirty years, whatever yep. it was. But yep. but yeah, that's uh, and we have these specially made uh, by that's uh, that's right. Pete, Pete doesn't he, these are custom for yeah, us. Yeah, yeah, because because this screw here. Um, traditionally would be here, yeah, which doesn't right. work too well if you yep. want a bridge pickup. Yep. So we had him shorten it up. And, and we could make the scale longer. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that would work out really, really well for us. Um, yeah, so I think the original ones didn't have as many frets because yep. of jazz box and stuff like that. Um, reveal binding. Look, and you, I love the edge of when you get crazy flame maple like that, and you get that the edge there you go. on that reveal binding is just like yeah. it just and you can see it, you can follow it through to the yeah. top. Yeah. So you know, oh, well, that's just a piece of the top, but mm -hmm. that's really cool. Yeah. Yeah, and this thing is really, really good. Even even on this camera, 
which doesn't always do everything 100% justice, this looks pretty darn good. And and if you want to see better pictures of that, if you go to the website, Joy's got new pictures of mm-hmm. uh, JJJ holding this guitar, yep. wishing, wishing it was his. And a bunch of the uh, pictures of just this guitar with no JJJ in it, if you've seen enough of him already. JJJ's got the original. Uh, he does. Yeah, deluxe. Mm-hmm. Oh, does he or does Bobby Dill have the original? Bobby Dill has the original. The very first, the prototype one that we made. Yeah, I guess you're right. Yeah, yeah. Um, yep. Yeah, so. Uh, Rob, I, 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 I agree with Dylan 100% on that. I think I think that would be cool and give you exactly what you want. Brandon Kaminsky says, I know it's late, but that metallic silver is funky. Funky and nasty. Yeah, yep. he says, great job. Um, uh, Brian says, I'm wanting one of those in my icon. But how are we going to do icons with with the CC? I, we've done them. They're a little different. I choose not to do it in the traditional way i, I want no i want to have it this you have to, this you have way to put a window yeah in it. yeah yeah the, yeah. the icons aren't thick okay. enough to do it the way that no yeah nope you would think they are they would be but they're not it's really really hard to slide it in and uh-huh. get it to fit and yeah uh doc owns that guitar yep yep what is this what is this guitar missing chris you, I mean, it's obvious, but you might be like, "Why? Well, that's not missing anything." Well, I, I think um, a really cool leather strap uh-huh. and a, a, a rock and roll attitude. Okay, but but and, and you're right. But but hold on, let me show. Now, what do you what do you what do you see that? It's oh, I know what, missing? what it is yeah. missing. Yeah, it's missing the the dollar bill signed by Matt and Jim that mm-hmm. that may or may not say, "I love butthole." But it may or may not. Yeah, I heart butthole. <laughs> Don't you know, worry, they, Mike. They all we'll say one in. They all say something different. Uh-huh. So yeah, um, so yeah, so these I, the we don't make okay. We don't make a lot of level fours. Okay, it's um, the it, but if but if you could only have one Texas Toast guitar, and you this is the one to have. The level four is is the one to have, not because the other ones aren't. You know, we, we make even less level threes. And I think it's because everybody just really digs the, uh, the carb top. The carb top. Yeah, the carb top yeah. is really cool. And it's not that much difference in price. Yeah. And yeah, this guitar good. is just. And what sick. is this thing? This is like. Really, it's pretty light. It's, I haven't weighed it it's yet. It's really um, light. Yeah. Yeah. The, the, the metal flake one is is slightly heavier. Oh, I did weigh heavy. it, and it's not even yeah, paint's heavier. It's got metal. It's, it's no, it's just however it works out. Yeah. Uh, well, for one thing, it's got that big giant uh, tremolo bridge, oh, which that's actually right. does weigh yeah. a fair amount more. Um, and it's not heavy. No. So, but this one actually feels light. Every time I picked up this guitar, yeah. I was like, "This thing's light," because it doesn't look like it should be light. Mm-hmm. It's, it's thick. Yeah. What what is it in the middle? Because this the side is a full. One and three quarters plus plus binding and top. Yeah, I I think I think I, I actually think the mahogany is one and a half. I think it's thicker than that. And then and then and then you got a three quarter inch top. I think man, maybe it's one and three quarters, and then you add the top. It's it's yeah, a nice it's thick chunk of chunk of wood. Two and two and some change. So yeah, yeah it's it's less Paul like in its Absolutely. thickness. Yeah, which yeah. is actually kind of cool. Yep. Yeah. So, if we okay, Chris, I think if we could make one guitar for the rest of our lives and sell this, them all, this might be if we could sell every single one of them yeah. and we make and we made them and we could sell them for whatever we wanted to. I would be perfectly happy to make this guitar over. Yeah, and over and over yeah, again. in in this color too. Hmm. I I get a huge yep. amount of satisfaction doing this guitar. Yeah, yeah. Just looking at this thing, this is uh, uh, this is classic and and unique and there's nothing pumpkin spice about this no and i don't think anything like this i don't think this is ever going to be like you're going to go ah, i wish i got it i wish i got the the the. i wish i would have got it with two humbuckers no well no. you know maybe maybe that but but you know this this paint job this this color scheme oh yeah i wish i got a green one. old <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah oh man i should have gotten the, the the one with the pink floyd fabric on it yeah yeah, yeah. that's the one i should have done yeah yeah i refuse to do that one 
God, this this thing is, you know, I, I'm I'm so proud of all the challengers. And 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 as you guys know, some of the ones I'm the most proud of are 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 our level ones and twos because they represent a, a pretty tremendous value. But when you get to when you get to do a couple level fours in the same reveal, it's um it's a it's man, it's which it's is neat. funny because I, I wasn't expecting mm -hmm. that that wasn't the plan on yeah. monday was oh, i'm gonna put together <laughs> a couple of the level mm -hmm. fours but mm -hmm. that's sort of what happened i built a bunch of guitars this week assembled a bunch of guitars you got did. a bunch of them 90 percent of the way there too just waiting on one piece or two piece yeah. mostly pickups mike says he's blown away well you haven't even wait played till, it yet wait, wait till you see the person it. yeah 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 it's yeah it's 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 quite something. You won't know whether to sing Christmas carols or pee your pants, Mike. You might as well just do both. Might as well. Yeah. I want to hear Frosty the Snowman and yeah. see a little. And wet yeah. trousers. <laughs> That's what I want. Yeah. Oh. Did you just pee your right. pants and sing Frosty the Snowman? <laughs> sure did. Sure did. <laughs> sure love this guitar. Oh, okay, gang. Well, I, I have you had enough reveals for one day, Chris? Yeah, I can only be this hilarious for so long you are you are truly wonderful so yeah um all right gang well uh we're gonna go ahead and wrap it up for this week uh we've got a uh, a video on sunday which if everything goes the way i want it to will be about a pleck pleck machine uh and getting a guitar plecked are you gonna call it go pleck yourself i mean yeah it's a good I, idea. I, but, I, but i don't know it might be that or it might but but there will be a sunday video at five o'clock mountain time and uh, uh, I'm, I'm going to go and edit those uh, here this weekend. So anyway, thanks for hanging out with us. For I hope that you guys stuck around for all the reveals. And, um, if and not, go back and watch the ones you did. Go back and watch and the ones you didn't like get. Yeah. And subscribe buttons. Yep. I, you know, I, there's something about this combination too, this Dylan P90 and the Pete Biltoff mm -hmm. uh, uh, CC rider. Dylan, by the way, says he will not make these. He counted up the number of pieces he would yeah. have to manufacture. Yeah. And he's like, no way. What's he charged for these? No way. Yeah. Yeah. No way I could, do, I would do that. Yeah. So yeah, it's, it's a neat pickup and it's a neat, it's a neat aesthetic. Yep. Ooh, God, this thing is awesome. Okay. Yeah, it is. All right, gang. Well, we will see you Sunday. Have a great weekend until then and uh, take care everybody and stay safe. Ooh, I'm, we have to get out in the snow. We get to get out in the snow. Yeah. <laughs>